Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at an AP view of the right ankle. Let's go ahead and start our timer. So the backstory on this exam is this patient fell down a set of stairs and came in complaining of right ankle pain. So right off the bat, just taking a generalized look at the anatomy, we have the distal tibula with the diaphysis and the metaphysis. We also have the distal fibula as well. We have the medial and the lateral malleolus. We have the talus here. We have some additional joints involving predominantly the midfoot, but on the AP view, as we can see, most of these osseous structures are superimposed. So looking at the alignment, we can confidently say that there's normal alignment. All of the joints appear to be approximated with normal joint spaces. We don't see any discrete lucency suggesting an acute or subacute post-traumatic deformity. However, we do see this chronic deformity involving the distal fibular shaft. We can tell that it's chronic because if we look, there's um, callus formation. There's also some osseous bridging, which means that this is a remote trauma that occurred sometime in the past and has subsequently healed. Looking at the soft tissues, we can see maybe a little bit of some soft tissue swelling here along the lower aspect. And I wouldn't be surprised if there's maybe a small joint effusion there as well. So if we were to interpret findings for this exam, we could say normal alignment with approximation of the joints, smooth tailor dome, no acute fracture, no focal osseous lesion, chronic post-traumatic deformity involving the distal fibular shaft, mild soft tissue swelling. If we were to write out an impression for this exam, we could say no acute finding, chronic distal fibular post-traumatic deformity. I hope you guys found this quick review helpful. If you have any questions at all, just drop them down below and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.